you read your Bible today? Let's walk through a scripture that God impressed in my heart. Psalms 23, 2 says, He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. Now this scripture was in my heart and I just thought, wow, this is such a powerful scripture. Can you imagine what it's like to lie down in green pastures? To be led beside still waters. Think of the connotations used in this verse. God is so good to you, so faithful, that he helps you find rest in a space where there is comfort, where there is peace, and where there is satisfaction. Think about the verbs to make, to lead. It suggests that oftentimes, although we might not know what we need, God does. While we worry and stress, God gently guides us to rest. There was a commentary by Philip Keller. He states that sheep do not lie down easily and will not unless four conditions are met. Because they are timid, they will not lie down if they are afraid. Because they are social animals, they will not lie down if there is friction among the sheep. If flies or parasites trouble them, they will not lie down. Finally, if sheep are anxious about food or hungry, they will not lie down. Rest comes because the shepherd has dealt with fear, friction, flies, and famine. Think about how powerful it is and think about this in your life. Think on how God meets all your needs comprehensively, therefore creating the optimal conditions for your rest. He guides you. When you are anxious, he guides you when there is friction. He guides you when there is stressors. He guides you when you are afraid. The exchange between the green pastures and still waters, they both imply that all of your conditions are met. All of your needs are met for comfort, for restoration, and for satisfaction. Wow. Think about how much God loves you. I pray that God makes you lie down in green pastures while leading you towards still waters. May you be soft-hearted, trusting God to lead you into opportunities of total restoration and satisfaction. In Jesus' name, amen.